Hi Sparkles, it's Jordan Sparks. Welcome back to my channel. In today's video, we are going to be reacting to this week's Dance Moms group dance called Body and Soul. So if you're interested in that, make sure to give this video a great big thumbs up. But if you're brand new to my channel, welcome. My name is Jordan Sparks. If you'd like to join the constellation, make sure to hit that juicy red subscribe button at any point during this video. And before we hop into this video, oh, my gosh, I was not expecting so many people to comment the secret word of the last video, which was glitter. So I literally have like 700 shout outs for this video. So we're going to figure out a way to do all those shout outs at the end of this video, but they will be there. So thank you to all of you guys that commented. I was not expecting that many. So we, we're not going to be doing a secret word for this week's video, but feel free to comment whatever you would like. That being said, I am going to be introducing a new kind of shout out to my channel and you guys have been asking me forever to start a Patreon and so I finally set up my Patreon last night. So I'm going to be leaving the link to my Patreon down in the description below and there's all different kinds of shout outs on there and I also have an option if you would like me to react to your dancing or if you would like to buy like an autographed glamour shot there's like a donation option for that and for like social media shout outs if you would like me to give you an Instagram or YouTube shout out or if you just like your name shouted out in one of my videos and yeah so I'm trying to make some interesting perks for you guys for Patreon. And if you guys have any other suggestions for different tiers, I am totally brand new to Patreon. Like this is not something that I was even looking into setting up. So if you guys know any other perks that I could offer to you guys that would be interesting, then definitely let me know down in the comments below. And also if you haven't checked out my Stay Sparkly merch, you can check that down below. It should all be right down below this video. And if you click any of those, items, it will bring you to Teespring where you can shop any of my Stay Sparkly merch. So if you're interested in that, that's all down below as well. Oh, also I dyed my hair purple and I cut it. What do you guys think? I did everything myself. So I'm pretty proud because I think it looks pretty dope for doing it myself. Um, but yeah, let me know what you guys thought. I did the light purple using that Dollar Tree hair dye that we tested in my one of my last videos. And then I went in and added some dimension around the edge and put in some low lights using a ultraviolet by Manic Panic. And then I cut my hair myself. Oh, and then I got some little matching uh, purple earrings from Claire's. <laughs> so <laughs> there's that. I'm honestly kind of obsessed. It makes me feel like some kind of anime character and I'm living for it. But also like, who's that? Isn't there like an evil, like purple haired guy from Hercules? I'm pretty sure there is. I can't remember. But all that being said, I guess let's hop right into the video. Oh my God. These headphones are working again. They haven't worked in like literally years. And I just, oh my God. Ah! <laughs> Thank you, Trisha Paytas. Okay, let's hop right into this reaction. Ladies and gentlemen, concluding our day here at Fierce Dance Challenge, entry number 118, Body and Soul. What perfect timing, like literally red rhinestone headphones to go with their red shiny costume. Yes, already, like, don't you guys see how much strength and control this team has? Like, especially because at the beginning of the season, everybody was picking on Hannah for being, like, the weak dancer. And I don't see a weak dancer on this team. Like, these are strong girls. I swear every single time that I see Lily do a backbend, I'm like, what? You have, do you have a spine? You, 
Oh, you do? Okay. Where? Um, but this dance is so in sync and their musicality is so great and I'm just, I'm living for it. They all did the Giannina arabesque move. They just like, they look like such a cohesive team and they all have such good lines and like, I know Abby literally searched high and low to get this group together and we have Eliana back so like that's a huge plus but I'm like this current group that we have on the stage right now is like ace. Okay, when Ellie prepared for that leap, she should have straightened her knee, so I'm just gonna point out that one little thing, but let's get back into this. Ow, my knees. Whenever they do all these tricks on their knees, I'm like, my knees do not like to do things like that anymore. Lily, when she comes up from her back bends, she still needs to let her head and her eyes, more specifically, be the last thing that comes up because she has a tendency to look up where she's going before she rolls up through her back. And Presley, I guess this is going to be a good comment, but... Presley, we had all of these comments about her looking short and stumpy while she was dancing, and I don't see a single short, stumpy dancer on that stage. Like, everybody looked long, everybody looks lean, and if I'm seeing long and lean by everybody on that stage, then Presley is doing her job. Hannah, I still really would like her to point so hard through her ankles and I'm sure that this is just something she's going to have to work on by doing foot exercises and stuff like that, but she has amazing turnout. She has great feet. She just really needs to point her ankles to complete a perfect line. Sarah, I have seen insane improvement in her technique over this season, so definitely two thumbs up for that. And her performance ability, she is always on while she is on stage. Giannina as well, I have seen lots of technical improvement throughout this season. Lily, amazing work, amazing improvement. Like, not so much just throughout this season, but her technique is amazing. Eliana, I feel, has not been in the competition world, so it's just going to be a little bit of a transition for her to get back to her peak technique while she's dancing, but I think that she's doing an excellent job, and I think that she's doing amazing. Anyways, there's a little comment for each girl, but let's hop right back into this. Okay, that part was the most impressive part for me out of this entire group dance. Sorry, I'm stopping so much, but to have them all travel stage right and do a turn perfectly synchronized, like that is difficult to do as a group, so props to them. Great musicality, very proud. I thought that they did an excellent job. I believe that this number came in fourth. Feel free to correct me down in the comments, but I thought it was fourth in the overalls. I don't really remember exactly, but I thought that they did a great job. I already gave most of my critiques, but overall I thought that they did an incredible job and they commanded attention on that stage and they were clean technically and performance-wise. There was a lot of commitment and energy. Now today's sparkling star is Ella Hart. I love you so much. Thank you so much for supporting my channel. If you would like to be the sparkling star in my next video, all you have to do is head on over to Twitter and follow me at Jordan J Sparks and retweet one of my video links when they go live and I will pick a new sparkling star for every single video. But all that being said, let's hop into the secret word shoutouts. I still am absolutely blown away that this many people commented. So thank you so much to all of these people
you guys are absolutely the best and honestly let's be real a sprinkle of glitter makes everybody's day better so sprinkle glitter on all of your problems throw glitter in your enemies faces <laughs> just kidding i feel like people could go blind if you throw glitter at them but like have you guys ever heard of like those glitter bombs where you like email or no you purchase a glitter package online and have it sent to like your worst enemy's house and they open it up and it's an envelope full of glitter because glitter lasts forever. Anyways, thank you so much to all of you guys. You guys are all sparkling stars. I love you so much. And thank you so much for taking the time to watch my video and taking the time to comment. And I guess that is it for this video. So thank you guys so much for watching. I love you guys so much. And as always, make sure to be weird, be wild, and stay sparkly, and I will catch you guys in the next video. Bye, guys.